Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's Epic Zara here, AKA Zara. I mean, my real name is Zara. My Instagram, Twitter, and everything else name is Epic Zara. So hey guys, welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, hey, how you doing? Hit that subscribe button, it's just down below. If you've been here before, thank you so much for keeping up with us. I'm back. I know it's been like a really long time, guys, but I promise I will not go on another random sabbatical like that. As you can see, my hair is in these really chunky twist braids, braid twists, whatever you want to call them, because I'm going to show you how I fluff my hair for maximum volume. These are the steps I take to make sure that my hair is super voluminous, popping, and poofy. If you'd like to see how I went from this over here to this right here, then keep watching. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, comment down below, and let me know how you guys fluff your hair and what product you use to make sure that your hair is super full of volume. Be sure to also subscribe to our channel and share this video with all your friends. If you see a sister or a brother out there with some flat hair, link them to this video because we did not go natural to suffer from limp, lifeless hair, you guys. Thank you so much and stay tuned for the video. Roof down, make me find a spot. Low key, I'm after all your locks. She said this feel like ecstasy. She love it when she lay in the ecstasy. Yeah, she said she sees the best in me. She said she sees the best in me. step to achieving really voluminous hair is doing large sections when you're doing your twist outs, braid outs, bantu knot outs. This helps to ensure that your hair is just going to be nice and chunky, nice and huge, and it should stretch it out more than doing smaller sections. As you can see, I did a braid twist thing. I like to braid my roots. This is another tip, that's tip number two. If you're doing something like a braid out or a twist out, I mean, of course, with a braid out, you have to braid your roots. But with my twist outs, I also like to braid my roots so that they're nice and stretched. Now, my hair is very kinky. It is type 4A, 4B, with a little bit of 4C sprinkled in there around here. So it's very kinky. In order to ensure that my hair doesn't tangle up, I usually like to stretch the roots. Of course, this also gives me plenty, plenty volume. Now we're going to begin taking down these twists. I'm just going to show you guys how I go about doing this. as I go but for the purpose of this tutorial I wanted to show you all how my hair looks right as soon as I take it out of these braid out twist out thingies braid twist twist braid whatever you want to call them <laughs> we're going to handle this situation and it's gonna be looking super popping you guys my next tip is gently separate each section I don't separate all the way to the ends so that the ends can be a bit neat and they don't frizz up. Get the camera, but we know be acting. Good girl, but she like the batting. All good girl, I like the batting. Hear me sing it up. Oh, baby, give me slow and steady. Rock the ball, control me. Why if you give me slow and steady? I'm addicted to you like fra, fra, fra. a little bit of progress it's not as fluffy as we want to be yet but we're getting there now for me fluffing is one of those things you just have to take your time and really work at it you can't just rush the process or else you're not going to get the results that you're looking for you have to just go in and really make sure that you force your hair to have that volume <laughs> the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to take our fingers and what I like to do is I like to just kind of put them on my scalp <laughs> and then like kind of just muss my hair. This kind of gets it looser. 
and be gentle. I also like to drag my fingers down so that it really fluffs everything very well. So all about baby come and talk, talk. Get the camera, but we know we act. Good girl, but she like the bad thing. All good girl, I like the bad thing. Hear me sing it out. Got me, I'm the only one. So the final thing I like to do is take my afro pick and just go to town. Like, I really just go ham with it. I especially focus on my roots. So as I'm taking it along my root, I'm also bringing it down my hair a bit just to give more volume. We want to make sure there are no gaps especially no gaps in the back because that's not cute and it's pretty unsightly. So there's a pretty big difference already. Let's keep going you guys. Let's move on to the other side. When they see you them they call me shot. See my girl, you they drive me mad. Rapunzel, make a grab a lad. It give me life when I see your eyes. Your skin tight, hugging on your ties. You be the bomb, girl, I'm glad you're mine. I wrote this song with you on my mind. See, girl, you got this thing that you do. When you do it, got me feeling like I'm a star. We don't watch nobody else. We don't need nobody else. We moving dread like a rasta. So all about baby, come and talk to Get the camera, but we know be acting. Good girl, but she like the bad thing. All good girl, I like the bad things. Hear me sing it up. Oh, baby, give me slow and steady. Rock the ball, control me. Why oh, forgive me slow and steady? I'm addicted to you like fra fra fra. Crushing like Mulana. Oh, baby, give me slow and steady. Take a shot, baby, write a caption. I'm bad, no Michael Jackson. But I can beat it, put it out of action You won't believe it till you're out of action We riding round through the city lights You say you know what a pretty night Roof down, make me find a spot We've officially finished fluffing our hair This is the final result I hope that this is helpful to you guys this is pretty much how I fluff my hair every time I'm trying to make sure it's super popping. If you guys want to see how I pretty much achieve this style, I'm going to link my braid out video right here. Yes, right here. So you guys can go and check that out. That's a detailed tutorial that demonstrates exactly how I achieve this kind of hairstyle. I'll also link my twist out right here so you guys can see that. This is low key a hybrid of the two but I think it's more of a braid out than anything. If you guys would like to see a video featuring all of my favorite products, I'm going to link that right here for you all. A lot of people ask me, Zara, what do you use on your hair? Zara, what's your favorite hair product? Zara, do you like this or that? And <laughs> my hair is actually extremely picky, so I figure I might as well just give you guys an updated favorite products video. I also have all of my faves linked in that description box if you guys are looking to purchase them. So go check that out. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Let's get this video to hopefully a thousand likes. That'd be pretty cool. Don't forget to share this video with all of your friends. Don't forget to comment down below and let me know how you fluff your own hair and what products you use to make sure your hair is super popping and fluffy and voluminous. Last but certainly not least, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you guys. I love you guys so much and I'm so glad to be back. I'll see you guys in another video coming very soon. You be the only thing that matter When they see you, them they call me shatter See my girl, you they drive me mad Rapunzel, make her grab a lad It give me life when I see your eyes Your skin tight, hugging on your ties You be the bomb, girl, I'm glad you're mine I wrote this song with you on my mind See, girl, you got this thing that you do When you do it, got me feeling like I'm a star We don't watch nobody else We don't need nobody else We moving dread like a rasta so all aboard, baby, come and talk to me. Get the camera, but